BBC Radio 2 icon Steve Wright is said to have died of a broken heart after losing his Radio 2 show, according to a friend. The 69-year-old, whose program was axed in 2022 after 24 years on the air, was found dead at his home in central London by emergency services on February 12. Mail Online said his death was described as unexpected but was not being treated as suspicious. However, celebrity publicist Gary Farrow, who was friends with Steve for 40 years, told The Sun, Steve lived for that show, he absolutely loved it, and the listeners loved him. My view is that he died from a broken heart. He was Mr. Showbiz. He was the first to discuss and champion new books, films, records and TV shows, and so progressive in that respect. So quite how the BBC could decide he was, too old, or not current enough is a joke. There was no one more current or on the pulse than Steve. There was no one more relevant. The BBC Stars show was taken over by former Radio 1 presenter Scott Mills. He continued working for the broadcaster by presenting Steve Wright's Sunday love songs every week. Steve's family released a statement confirming his death, which read, It is with deep sorrow and profound regret that we announce the passing of our beloved Steve Wright. In addition to his son, Tom, and daughter, Lucy, Steve leaves behind his brother, Lawrence and his father, Richard. Also, much-loved close friends and colleagues, and millions of devoted radio listeners who had the good fortune and great pleasure of allowing Steve into their daily lives as one of the UK's most enduring and popular radio personalities.